Workers at an operating nuclear plant in southwestern Japan have run into problems. They found cracks and leaks in pipes that supply seawater for cooling steam. The reactor was the first to go back online under new regulations introduced after the Fukushima nuclear accident in 2011. Workers discovered the problem last Thursday at a condenser for the Sendai plant's number one reactor. Employees with Kyushu Electric Power Company found elevated salt levels in the machine. The condenser uses seawater to turn steam from the turbine back into water. The reactor has three condensers and each one is equipped with 26,000 thin pipes that carry seawater. Utility officials have been inspecting the pipes, finding cracks in five of them at one condenser, and they say seawater had leaked from them. Workers stopped the flow of water by putting plugs into the five pipes. They're now checking other ones. Officials with the plant operators say they'll keep running the reactor. plant that opens in Japan. You would think after four and a half years they would have picked the best new plant that wouldn't have an issue. But already we've had two major problems around the Sendai plant. First you have the five calderas that are surrounding it. You have this uh, eruptions that are coming around this plant. That's huge volcano eruptions. Now we're finding five pipes that have been leaking from the Sendai plant and they had to plug them up 